Well, as House Democrats ready the articles of impeachment against President Trump, a Republican-run Senate committee is now hosting the Justice Department's internal watchdog today. Yeah, they're quizzing him about a new report into an old thorn in the president's side, the Russia investigation. Alice Barr has the latest from D.C. Two congressional committees, two different missions today. On the House side, Democrats preparing for debate tonight on the articles of impeachment that President Trump calls weak. The president has to make his own kind of defense. Unfortunately for him, he doesn't have any facts on his side. While Senate Republicans take up a separate hearing and a new headline, questioning the Justice Department's Inspector General Michael Horowitz about his report into the origins of the Russia probe. We found no, no bias. Horowitz concluding that the FBI had good reason to open an investigation into possible Russian influence on the Trump campaign during the 2016 election. The findings undercut the president's frequent claims of a witch hunt, but at the same time. That so many basic and fundamental errors were made by three separate handpicked investigative teams on one of the most sensitive FBI investigations. The inspector general detailing serious mistakes in the court application to monitor an ex-Trump campaign aide, including relying on unverified information. The president claiming something Horowitz did not, tweeting, they spied on my campaign. What happened here is not a few irregularities. What happened here is the system failed. Senator Lindsey Graham echoing the same language Democrats have used against President Trump. You were able to uncover and discover abuse of power I never believed would actually exist in 2019. Republicans offering a preview of how they'll defend the president if it comes down to a Senate impeachment trial next month.